everybody. Thank you for joining me today. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe. Today I'm going to be working on a 36 by 48 inch canvas. It's pretty large. I've got some great ideas and some really beautiful colors and I think it's going to turn out great. But let's see what happens. Part one of my uh, 36 by 48 painting. There's already so many beautiful details here. There is the part that just didn't get covered, but I can work with that. It's okay. I think I can make it work. And I love the way it's kind of like floating down here. It's quite beautiful. Well, a couple little spots I have to fix there. And these beautiful cells are popping up. And then the foam kind of seems to be coming over. Love that as well. And I love the lighter color, the light blue up here and the greeny blue. Turquoise color, it's quite beautiful coming through with the next to the dark blue. That's the Payne's gray. And then the light gray is kind of everywhere. So it's quite beautiful to begin with. I have to let this whole thing dry. It's probably going to take a whole day. So I will work on this again tomorrow. When you see me again, it'll be dry. <laughs> Hi everybody. I had every intention to show you the fluid pour part of this painting, but I felt that the video was just too long. So I decided to show you as I started enhancing it. So sit back, relax and enjoy the music and most importantly the painting. It's just a noisy hall where there's a nightly brawl and all that jazz.
So here are the colors that I used, a white for the um, kind of splashing part that I did at the end, Amsterdam light blue, Amsterdam tur turquoise green, and Liquidex light blue, Amsterdam titanium white, Liquidex burnt sienna, burnt umber, and raw sienna, and uh, Valspar shark loop kind of a light gray and here is my painting out in my garden it's the end of September so I don't have a lot of beautiful uh, flowering but you can see it, the painting out here quite beautifully and I'll show you the details up close I decided to add in this last rock. I thought we needed a little bit more of a focal point at the bottom of this kind of low-lying area in the ocean. And this I changed. It was originally up on kind of this area, but I changed it to that and I'm much happier with it there lots of beautiful detail the colors coming through and this final kind of rock up there and the sky is very plain which I felt it needed in this painting with all the detail and the horizon is a straight line with kind of an idea that there's people living way out there maybe there's some mountains you go quite beautiful I think <laughs> I'd love to hear what you think as well please leave me a comment and if you click on the link you see now you can see a lot more of my paintings and here it is one last time